look over your shoulder Why don't you come over to me Got something to show you Hey girl, look over your shoulder Why don't you come over to me Got something to show you Do you like what I'm showing you You should do cause I see from the way you're yeah, so right about now here at the ADS shoot and like we're gonna take the first shot of the day as I was saying, trying to set things up. And like all these hot Brazilian girls in the place. Roxy, watch, watch, watch Roxy now, watch him like, watch him like, in his hat trying to like, all the girls like, ooh, Roxy, Roxy, ooh, look at your arms. There's a whole lot of shaking going on, I like that. Yeah, yeah. Are you sure between us we can handle all this shaking? Yeah. I I'm gonna try. Are you gonna try? I, I don't know. I think, we owe it, I think we owe it to our manager over there. I think you're right, I think you're right. Yeah, so Hamish, what's going on, man? I'm um, just hoping it all comes together. Ladies are looking beautiful. It's a good start. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good. So here we are with the director, um, also Nava. What are you saying, bro? Uh, it's all going good. So how's it looking for today? It's looking good. I think we've got a nice location. We've got, we've got some great performers. And we've got some nice looking girls as well, which doesn't hurt. So I think it's, it's a lot of the elements are in place for a good day and a good video. So tell me what it's going to be. I'll tell you now I'm not your man and I don't want to be. Keeping you here, but your company would honor me. So let it be on the D, you and me tonight. So now for your energy. And I know that you want to see the other me. Let it lead to the final discovery. It would feel so nice. The girl that run by me, fill up the girl that run on it. Giddy giddy girl that to me, fill up, fill up, fill up the girl that not it. Hey girl, look over your shoulder. Why don't you come over to me? Got something to show you. Hey girl, look over your shoulder. Why don't you come over to me? We're setting up this shot, right? And um, Ricky brings out one of the girls to the front, and also goes, No, 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 no. Get to the back. Sorry, love, get to the back. Shh, shh. Now moved into a few shots. We're trying to incorporate um, the Hey Girl. So um, amazing uh, DJ, She Devil, decided to step up to the plate. And it's called a bit, it's caused a bit of beef, actually, because like Envy, the first girl from the first shoot, was like, hold on a minute, how can the next girl just come in and step into my place? Like, that's not right. Well, don't be shy, man. Come on. Just to my head. Introduce yourself, man. Yeah, um, well, I'm JC. I've just done a remix of the Hey Girl thing, uh, which they're going to be releasing as the, the next little part to the Hey Girl sort of episode. So, yeah. Tell us more about what you're up to, because you're doing lots of stuff outside of remixes. Uh, and at the moment, um, what have I got on? I've got a Sugar Bay's remix. I'm doing a new single. I've got a um, project going on with this woman called Joy Malcolm, who's like, um, she's a big kind of old gospel singer. We're going to do like a summer anthem for next year. Uh, Apart from that, doing some like music library, CD music, um, just kind of doing it for MTV and that sort of thing. You should do, because I see from the way you move. You pull your proof of space that I'm giving you to do what you got to do, because it feels so right. By the way, I should be telling you, I'm a man, here's a dance to trouble you. But if you give me the chance to discover you, it would feel so nice. Hey girl, look over your shoulder. Why don't you come over to me? Got something to show you. Hey girl, look over your shoulder. Why don't you come over to me? So how are you feeling about the shoot so far, bro? I'm just telling people we're gonna go and check She Devil out and have a chat. Yeah, I'm feeling alright actually. I've just been talking to She Devil, and. She's so buff. You've been talking to her cleavage, right? I'm, no, I've been talking to her face. No, I can't be honest. I'm being honest. Right. I'm being honest. I'm a gentleman. I'm, I'm, I'm a gentleman. I'm a jibble gentleman. I'm a jibble gentleman. Yum, 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 yum. Man, a jack of all trades, you know what I'm saying? In there, up front, in the camera, having fun, behind the screens, making sure everyone's gums are looking crisp, you understand? No long thing. This brother always jacking food, man. It's only water, bruv. It's you can get that from a tap, it's free. 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 <laughs> Now the thing is, right, I'll be straight with you, like, we had an issue earlier, because, like, there's a whole thing here with the whole music video thing, you know, there's a certain look certain people thought we were going to go for, which is this whole kind of, you know, generically beautiful looking, stunning girls thing. And hey, you know what? It's all good. I'm not afraid to say, hey, you're a pretty lady, come up in the video, it's all good. We're trying to get, a, mm, get the right thing rolling. So, so, like, yeah, bruv. <laughs> So uh, <laughs> we had to make a decision between the marvellous She-Devil and another marvellous lady that had the, you know, the decency to come down and support us here with the vid. So now we've, we've hooked it up, we've worked out that She-Devil is going to be the one that's going to be running things. So we're going to try and have a chat with her, find out what she's up to and what's going on. 
that you're like a big time DJ at the moment, running things. Like, I wanna know where you've been playing, how it's grown for you, how you got into the whole thing. Well, I'm the first and only female DJ ever to be signed in America. Woo -woo. No. <laughs> how did you hold that up? Basically, I got off my lazy ass and I went to Miami with my records and went over there and just told them that I'm a good DJ and they should give me a chance and they did. Now straight up, yeah, a lot of people think that it, it's purely because you might have to sleep with somebody to get places. Is that the case Is it on your pure raw talent? Raw talent. You see that? You see that? You know what? People can get girls any time of the week, but you have to have a talent to get into this kind of this kind of industry because at the end of the day what are you going to do you're going to sleep your way somewhere and then you're going to get put behind turntables on the spot what are you going to do you can't lay down then you got to represent them and i do every time got something to show you bring up the girl and run by me fill up the girl and run on it get the get the girl to me fill up fill up fill up the girl and run it bring up the girl and run by me fill up the girl and run on it get the get the girl to me fill up fill up fill up the girl and run it Introduce you to a gentleman that is very special to me, a gentleman by the name of Keith Harris. How are you doing? How are you, Keith? Nice spin. Good to see you. Yeah, absolutely. It's been a while. There you go. <laughs> so we've been up to. Every time uh, I like send you a text or something, you're like in some other country, uh, living well, it up. Well, I've been back here for a while. I'm, I'm, I don't have to go anywhere. I'm going to have to go to Uganda in about six weeks. But apart from that, I'm, I'm here. Go to musictank.co.uk if you want to find out about the business. You can go to ppluk.com to find out about picking up your money. And you can go to the University of Westminster if you're looking for an education. Okay. That's right. I mean, you, I mean you've been teaching there for quite a while. Uh, you yeah, kind of, nearly, nearly 15 years. Were you partly involved in setting the course up? Yeah, well, yeah, I was. I was on, on the professional advisory body and I helped write the, the music business part of the course. It's been an amazing day and I like, have to say props to everyone that made it down, including this gentleman here who like, like explain the journey because it wasn't an easy thing for you today. No, no, I came from, um, I was doing a festival in France, in Marseille, with uh, MOP and Most Def and a whole bunch of people, so I kind of left that. It didn't matter if I was in the video or whether people see me, but I had to be here, watch it, and you know I mean? make sure I was here. See, now, this gentleman's been modest, right? Like, if you go to Ty's MySpace page, remind us of the, how we get there. Yes, myspace.com forward slash Ty and upwards, T-Y and upwards. We got so many hits, so many people passing through the MySpace page just from a little bulletin and that we love that, you know what I'm saying? It doesn't take much to help somebody. This no, is it's, it's, it's culture, it's our, it's our culture, we should be doing that. We shouldn't be doing it because money's exchanging hands. We should be doing it because we trust each other's music. How are you feeling about it today, man? I'm happy, man. It happened quite quickly. Um, hope they've got all the shots in that they're looking for. It was good fun. I like, really like the club, really like the atmosphere. It's amazing how, how much energy people have brought to it. You know what I'm saying? Because we've been trying to get that balance between doing something that everyone will be into, but also trying to show some love to the people that have supported us and got us this far. So, you know, it's all about that. That's the way I air this role. That's how the spoon face and arms, that's yeah. how we do our things. Thanks to everyone that came down. Thanks to this man here for singing the song in the first place. And thanks to this guy for doing some of them drum things on the track and all that. Get me that. Cat, cat, cat. Last one, man. Yeah.